What's up guys, it's San here from Crypto Kiwi. Now in this video today, I'll be teaching you about Binance Futures. Now Binance Futures allows you to trade with leverage, which means it's very high risk and it's very, very volatile, but it basically allows you to trade with more value than you currently have in your portfolio or in your first position or your trading position that you make through Binance Futures. So if you haven't signed up to Binance yet, my link is up there above right now and also down in the description. Do sign up using my link. You will get a discount on fees for life through Binance and you also get a discount on Binance Futures. So it's really, really cool. If you already have a Binance account, then no worries. You are already uh, logged in or you already have access to Binance Futures. You just have to log into your Binance account, go derivatives, Binance Futures overview. And today I'll be showing you the USD-M Futures through Binance. So basically to get some funds into your binance futures account you just have to go transfer from your fiat and spot wallet now your fiat and spot wallet is where you traditionally have your crypto stored for your trading through binance so you just transfer it from that and you can obviously select uh many different coins bnb bsd or usdt and then once you have some balance into your binance futures wallet you are good to go so i'm going to be showing you guys binance futures with btc against usdt and like i said guys this is leverage trading so it's very very high risk but in this video i'm going to show you guys how that works this is not a financial advice it's simply just showing you how this works um, and it's totally up to you what you want to do with your own trading so to get started let's just have a quick look now as you can see this looks pretty much very very similar to how binance usually works or just most normal exchanges and that way it makes it very very simple now as you can see bitcoin is currently trading at just over forty-seven thousand us dollars and i'm going to be doing some leverage trading through binance futures so as you can see i also have 99.6 usdt sitting in my futures account to do some trades with so this is probably the most important part when it comes to binance futures trading or leverage trading is selecting your leverage now if you don't know what this means i'm going to give you a very very basic rundown so one times my leverage if i was to use my entire futures available balance which is 99.6 usdt would be trading with 99.6 USDT or US dollars worth of value. Whereas with leverage, it allows you to borrow and pretty much use up to 125X worth of your position, meaning that instead of just trading with 99.6 USD, I could effectively trade with well over 10 or 11 and a half thousand dollars, or of this position, I could trade with over 12 and a half thousand dollars with one single trade. Now that sounds really cool and all, but do keep in mind that the higher leverage you trade with, the higher the risk of being liquidated that you are running. So be very, very careful with this. So for example, I'm going to trade with 10x leverage just to show you guys how this basically works. So as you can see, I have 99.6 US dollars sitting in my futures account. I'm going to use all of that and I'm trading with 10x leverage, which allows me to buy up to 0.021 Bitcoin currently about 1000 US dollars worth of Bitcoin. Now I can either do a buy or lot like buy slash long position or a sell slash short position. So a buy slash long position means that I'm basically buying the Bitcoin and I'm planning to sell it back when it gets to a higher price, therefore making a profit. If I'm selling or shorting it, I'm basically selling or shorting Bitcoin, meaning that I'm betting that it's going to go down in value and I would, I'm going to profit off it going down. So Bitcoin currently at 47,000 US dollars. I select the price I'd like to buy it, go 100% if I'd like and do a sell order. So I've just submitted a sell or short order, basically betting that Bitcoin will go down um, not long after my position is executed. And as you can see here, this is my position. As soon as it hits around here, it's going to get executed. Here we go, 47,000, sorry, 16 US dollars, just waiting for that position to get executed. And if you're going to wait for your position like me, you can wait for it. Otherwise, you can go open orders, click cancel, go confirm and select a new price to buy in at and do your short position and like i said guys i'm trading at 10x leverage there we go we're in we're in so i got in at the price of 47,020 us dollars and i'm shorting bitcoin meaning that i'm betting that the price is going to go down and i'm going to profit off it but guys i'm not just playing with my 99 us dollars i'm playing with 999 us dollars because i have chosen a 10x leverage position meaning I'm borrowing 10x my current position 
to play with so it's very gambling like um, and very very high risk so what I mean when I say that the higher the leverage the higher the risk of liquidation well as you can see here currently if Bitcoin got up to the price of $51,538 so roughly about $4,000 more than what it is currently four and a half thousand dollars more my 99 US dollar position will be completely liquidated which means sold and I will lose that 99 US dollars that's because I've done a sell or short position betting that Bitcoin's price will go down and I would like to profit off it going down. So of course, if it goes in the opposite direction, which is up, and if it goes further enough, and remember I'm borrowing 10X my current position, that for, therefore my position will get liquidated at $51,538. Now, of course, let's just say Bitcoin fell to $43,000 and I want to sell at $43,000. That means Bitcoin's fell quite a bit. My profit or loss will be quite high and I want to sell at that price. But hey, I don't want to sit behind my computer for the next 24 hours waiting for it to reach that price. You can set a take profit or stop loss position. So if I want to do a take profit, I can just select 43,000 US dollars. So if Bitcoin hits 43,000 US dollars, I will make 84 US dollars profit. Remember I entered with 99, so that's almost, almost a 100% return. If Bitcoin falls $4,000, I will almost double my original amount. Now let's just keep in tact that, hey, you can get liquidated. Like I said, if Bitcoin goes up and reaches $51,500, I will get liquidated. So you can also set a stop loss, which pretty much means you are choosing to sell your position at a loss, but instead of a full loss. So currently, if Bitcoin hit $51,500, my position of $99 US dollars will be completely liquidated, meaning I lose that total $99 US dollars. Whereas if I did a stop loss of $48,500, I would lose 30 out of my 99 US dollars, making it a loss, but not a complete loss. So this gets really, really beneficial and helpful to you when you start trading with bigger volumes. So I'm just gonna set a take profit of 44,500 and a stop loss of 48,500 set those in and now i can rest assured that if this goes in the opposite direction than what i'm hoping it what does well the, the the direction i've betted sorry i'm losing my words um then i won't lose or be liquidated on my full amount i won't lose my full amount i will only lose a partial amount because i've requested binance to sell my position at forty eight thousand five hundred dollars and same in the other direction, if Bitcoin starts going down in value, I've asked Binance to close my position at $44,500 US dollars, bringing me a take home profit of about 50 US dollars off my 99 US dollar position, which is about a 50% uh, return on my position. So like I said, guys, very, very risky, very, very high and very, very volatile. Now, at any time you can just sell these at market rates as well so let's just say that i wanted to sell now i'd be selling that at 1.68 percent loss but i'm just going to do this to show you guys how this works i just click market and bam my order sold and i lost 1.5 or 1.6 percent of my position now i'm down to 97 us dollars so now i want to enter back in let's just say i want to trade with a higher leverage so just remember guys my liquidation position before was fifty one and a half thousand US dollars. Let's just say I want to trade with 50 times my current position with leverage. So that means I currently have about a hundred US dollars and if I'm playing with 50 times that amount, I'm currently playing with about five thousand US dollars. Meaning if I'm wanting to make a position, let's just say I want to short Bitcoin right now because it's gone up a wee bit and I'm feeling confident I'm going to go sell short. Bam, order submitted, and it's now sitting on the open orders. We'll wait for this to execute. There you go, the market has executed my order. Oh, it should have. Hold on a moment. There you go. There it is. Uh, hold on. No, so I did $47,082. We're waiting for it, waiting for it. We're getting very, very close. So you can either, in this position, you can either wait for the market to execute your order, or you can cancel and pick a different price that will execute quicker. And for the sake of this video, I'm going to do that. So I'm going to pretty much sell uh, my BTC at live rates like that, speed it up a wee bit. Let's just see how this goes. Perfect. Now my position is open. Here we go. So now I'm trading with 0.1 Bitcoin, which currently is 4,700 US dollars worth of Bitcoin, but I only have 99 or 97 US dollars in my account. 
this is the cool thing about leverage it gives you the opportunity to trade at much higher values than you originally have but the risk is very high now that we're trading at 50x leverage i've also made a sell short position but would you look at the liquidation price it's no longer 51,500 it's 47,800 dollars so if bitcoin reaches 47,800 dollars i will lose my complete full position which is my 97 us dollars hopefully this makes sense for you guys if it doesn't please ask below in the comments but as you can see very very high risk um i've done a bit of leverage trading in my past back going back a few years um and it it's been very good but just remember it is extremely high risk this is not financial advice and do choose your leverage carefully that's where it matters the most so as you can see here i've uh, done a sell or short position of bitcoin right now i'm minus three or minus four percent at the loss if i was to sell at live market rates but once again i'm going to set a take profit position of forty-five thousand us dollars if bitcoin reaches forty-five thousand, dollars uh, we'll just say five hundred dollars i will make 164 us dollars of profit off my 97 us dollar position so that's not a bad profit that's over a hundred percent return so that's not too bad but of course the market has to go down and reach that level for me to take home that kind of profit now Thanks for watching guys, my name is Sun from Crypto Kiwi. hopefully this is, has explained a bit for you before, and like I said, down below is my, in the description, sorry, is the link to Binance, which gives you discounts on trading fees for life, so definitely sign up using my link, it supports me here on the channel, and you also get discount fees for life, so it's a win-win situation. Do like the video if you enjoyed this, if it was beneficial or informative to you, and if you haven't already, do subscribe to the channel, I will see you in my next video.